Hi, I'm Steph from Simplicity Happens. And today we're going to learn how to create bat clip art in PowerPoint. And this is a great tutorial for parents, teachers, and kids. Best yet, these cute bats can be made in a matter of five to six minutes. If you're enjoying my videos, please subscribe to the Simplicity Happens channel and hang tight. We can get ready for the bat video now. Hello and welcome. Let's get started creating our bat. The first thing we're going to do is go to insert shapes and we're gonna go down to the black arrow section and select the arrow chevron. Once we see the plus sign, we can click on our mouse and drag to make the shape bigger. This will be the bat's wings. I'm going to go up to the top of the shape and turn it using that circular arrow. And then I'm going to align center. I'm going to put the shape fill in black and outline in black. Next, I'm going to go to insert shapes and select the oval. I'm gonna click and drag the circle out to make it bigger. I'm going to align center and I wanna shape fill in black and outline in white. That will give me a little definition for the face against the bat's wings. Next, I'm gonna go into shapes and select the triangle to make the bat's ears. I'm gonna put those in black and outline in white. And then I'm gonna copy and paste and put one on the other side. All right, next we'll go into insert shapes and create the eyes. I'm going to select the oval shape and I'm gonna click and drag. I'm gonna put the shape fill in white and the outline in black. I'm gonna copy and paste to make a pupil by making it a little smaller. I'm gonna put that in black and outline in black. And then I'm going to group these two shapes together. And then I'm gonna copy and paste the eye to make another eye. I'm aligning the eyes up nicely. Next, I'm gonna go into insert shapes and select the moon shape under basic shapes. I'm gonna click and drag and then I'm gonna find the orange circle here on the top middle part of the moon and I'm going to pull that out. I'm gonna turn it and I'm gonna put this in red outline in black to create the bat's mouth. I'm gonna pull this over and then tweak as I like. going to align center. And then lastly, I'm going to go into insert shapes and I'm going to select the triangle shape. And I'm going to make the shape a bit narrow because I'd like to make the bats fangs. I'm going to shape fill in white outline in black. I'm going to thicken up the fangs just a little bit. 
the one and a half points there. And then I'm going to copy and paste another thing to the other side. Once that's completed, I'm going to go in and group all of the shapes together. So once all of the shapes are selected, I'll go up to group and group. And that means I'll be able to take the shape wherever I'd like. Don't forget to save your image as a picture so that you can keep it somewhere special on your computer. And of course, always keep a draft photo so that you can go in and make modifications to your picture. So for example, if I want to create my bat in a different color, I can. So for example, let's say I wanted to create this bat in purple. I'm going to go in and select each of the shapes that I want to change the color of. So I'm gonna go in to shape fill purple and then I'd like to change this outline color on both the face and ears to black. And I'm going to make it a little thicker. And I'm also going to make the wings a little thicker too. So I did three points for all of those. All right. So there you have some cute little bats that you can use for activities around this time of year. I hope you've enjoyed this video with me. I hope you have a great rest of your day or evening, and I'll be back again next week with another clip art video. Bye.